Hello my shinies, my name is 7447 and welcome back to some more Gloomhaven. So before we begin, I just want to say that I actually have a sore throat right now. So I apologize if maybe I sound a bit weird tonight. Hopefully my voice won't crack so much and don't you worry, I will take a good night rest today. So without further ado, let's dive into some more Gloomhaven. First of all, let's go and do another city encounter looking for a little bit of variety you head down to the brown door as night falls after some wait you pass through the doors and are surprised to see the sawbones sitting near the back of the room by himself considering this bar is about as seedy and corrupt as they come it is just about the last place you would expect to find him I just I don't know what to do now the sawbones confesses after you sit down. I'd like to join the sanctuary and lead a nice quiet life, but after adventuring with all of you, that just doesn't seem fulfilling anymore. He shakes his head. I don't know. This life seems so boring now. What do you think? Tell him that joining the sanctuary is the right thing to do. Of course. What's wrong? What's wrong? Oh yes. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's so good. And yeah, my voice is totally screwed up right now, okay? <laughs> I guess you're right, he shrugs. Here's to one last night of freedom. He lifts his glass and gulps down the contents. You follow his lead and the rest is a blur. Gotta stay hydrated. Ah, leave. Good. Prosperity is always good. Can't go wrong with it. Temple of Great Oak, I'm going to bless. Okay, my is already bad. Never mind. Can we buy something? Oh yes, we can. I'm definitely buying something. Moon earring. The thing. Healing. Major healing. Sorry. I think she can buy ooh a jagged sword. Hmm. I can poison something and wound them. Oh wow. Everything is so good. I'm on it. Jagged or a piercing bow. Piercing bow, yeah, that's what we bought last time. Buying a major healing potion. Minor. Yeah, why not? It's okay. As for you, sir, you definitely need the boots. First things first, you need the boots. Boots of strong. you got everything oh actually uh you are getting stun wow minor stamina yeah and yeah by the way we cannot equip the same item two of the same item so since she already has minor stamina potion minor power so she cannot uh, equip another mi minor stamina potion. What we really want is the major stamina potion, but it's not available right now. So, probably major healing potion. It's fine, it's a bit expensive, but it's okay. She has the money. Alright, so let's begin. We got multiple choices. We can go. Hmm. Core quest, side quest, magma, disrupt another cultist ritual nearby. Hmm. Oh, another core quest. Hold on. Oh, two treasures. Okay. 
Lucky Jack Sarah Core Quest Side Quest Sunken Vessel Oh yeah Three shield seems tough. Everything seems tough without my favorite character. <laughs> mm, I guess we can do this one. No. Uh, her battle goals require forests maps, so I guess. I guess we can do this one, it's fine. Frost Demon Hound Living Spirit. Okay. Yes, we can go. An enchanter has been called for, so an enchanter must be found. Following reports of an Aether in the Boiler District, you find yourself standing before an abandoned and decrepit tavern, the Crooked Bone. Opening the door, the inside looks exactly as the outside advertised. Spider webs, splintered stools, and dusty, broken glass. Stepping past the threshold, a translucent female suddenly appears before you. Why have you come to this place, mercenaries? Your presence is unwanted, and you're disrupting my research. You quickly explain why you have come, and the woman's frown deepens. Oh, look at the Aether woman. She can fulfill all our wishes. All she has to do is wave her hands, and our wildest dreams will come true. She sighs in frustration, and actually does wave her hands. Leave me in peace! You don't move. She stares. Well, instead of disrupting, then maybe you could help. Scratch my back, maybe I'll scratch yours. That's how these things work, right? The woman turns and walks towards a destroyed set of stairs. But after a few steps, she fades away in I need an orb from the frozen hollow in the Copperneck Mountains. The woman's voice comes from directly in front of you, as if she hadn't moved at all. Bring it back to me, and I may help you. A map drops at your feet. My name is Hale, by the way. Do not come back without the orb. Oh, and by the way, if I start coughing in the middle of recording, I apologize. <coughs> Riding up on horses, band of dirty, rough men. Quickly overtake and surround your group. They look hard and dangerous. And immediately pull out your weapons as they approach. Then you hear a familiar laugh. Well, if it isn't my old crew, a woman in dark leather armor comes to greet you. You know what, boys? This slot gets a pass. Oh, it might be the scoundrel that we retired. She winks at you and turns around. Plus, they'd probably kill you if all things turn ugly. Jumping back into our horse, the scoundrel looks back at you. Well, it's nice seeing you. Just remember, you never saw me. You should be brought to justice. Let the bandits go. Gosh. Oh my gosh. Friend or not, those who prey on the weak. Brought to justice. It's, it's a bandit. Uh, attack or not? What do you think? Attack? I think I'll attack. Attack. Relax a little and begin to form up. That is when you strike. Some are scared off by the sudden attack, but others engage you hungrily. The scoundrel throws a few daggers too before she rides off, criticizing your poor decision making. Poison. Suffer two damage. It's fine, we got healing potion. The map is easy to follow. Deep in the Copperneck Mountains, obscured by snowdrifts, you find the opening to a dark, narrow cave. The wolf tracks around the entrance are troubling, but with a firm resolve, you enter. I think that's it. Kill a monster at least four. Okay. No one should. Exhausted. Kill five or more. Easy. Sixteen or more XP. That should be easy. He has incomplete. Oh, okay. So I forgot to put this. Okay. 
Thank you, game, for reminding me. Dark Frenzy. Most definitely. To the night feedback loop. Yep. Oh, okay, good. Let's go. We got this. Easy. This should be easy. Living Spirit, Frost Demon, and Hounds. You know, an old friend, the scoundrel, a bandit. Like, I, I can't help it. Who knows? Maybe I thought we'll, we'll get prosperity because less bandits attacking innocent people. I suppose. Okay. Hounds are annoying. Oh boy. So we got two more rooms. This should be connected. I think I remember doing this scenario before with the board game, of course. One, two, three. Uh, a bit too far away to do open wound. Okay, uh, I think I can. One, two, three, four. goes invisible yes special mixture you know. throwing knives okay good Wolves are not so fast. Four, five. One. One. Let's see. If I move here, she will act like a wall. So one, two, three, four, five. It, it should still hit the doctor. I'll do it. Wow, attack four. Ouch. She got him to heal. Thank you. 
Master's Review. Two. Minor healing potion. Nah. So. Fresh my minor standard pollution. Yep, just like that. <laughs> yep. Oh, come on. Minus two. Oh. Okay, good. Two minus two. Oh my gosh. Mm, stun. to wound the the enemy. Okay in that case oh gosh this is the absolute worst okay let's try that one uh open wound special mixture is key try okay heal self ah, we don't want that wolf should die from scoundrel I guess Stun. Nice. Put 
poison the wolf. Open wound should kill it. If this fa oh never mind this arm, I thought I'm I'm gonna attack and then it retaliates me, but no, it's literally just yeah this arm, everything around the sawbone. So yeah, th this works quite well for me. I still need to oh dark frenzy and. Mind's weakness. Okay, cool. enemies within range Ooh, okay. oh we got doesn't matter uh, I guess I'm going here skip movement try and shoot this one Oh, invisible. Okay, that one is dead. Because it's flying, so I can pull it there. I kind of, we kind of have to make sure this one dies. So. Please, please. Oh, yes. That's it. Everything does. What? Empowering Talisman is back? I did not know this. This is so good. What? You know what this means, right? I can do this. I can bring it back. Curative mixture back. And then... And then use it and get back minor stamina again. <laughs> this is so awesome. I did not know this. I really did not know this. Wow. That is awesome. Yeah, cool. So, we learn something new every day. And then I'm just going to... <coughs> oh, excuse me. Feedback loop. She is going to... Swift bow map pack. No, she doesn't need to. Uh, long rest. He can do this and then that. That's it. Can I prepare to open the door. Wait. Am I being dumb again? Close door. Okay. Oh, it's a closed door. Okay, never mind. Nope, uh, I'm going the right way. No, nothing, never mind. Heal yourself. I'm too afraid to see what's in there.
again just gonna force gate precaution she is going to do she's going to be extremely slow As for scout, uh, as for VV, I didn't like that scurry. Okay. So. Shield 2, move 4. Move 5, okay. Move 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Huh. Don't retaliate. Take the invisible again. Yeah, I may have used the overload too fast. Cranium overload too soon. Oh boy. <coughs> Consume ice to do stun. I kinda need Trixers reveal this thing. Open wound and something. Open wound and something. Yeah. What can I do? Throwing knives. Prevention is key. Ooh, oh, but I'll get retaliated if I do this. Ah, what 
is this madness? Vaccine. Ooh, this one and vaccine. Mm, doable. He's slower though. Consume any element to generate ice. Wait, attack two and pierce, oh no. I'm gonna do something a bit crazy. No, actually. Oh, wait, wait, hold on. What cards does she have? Into the night. Oh, she has Into the Night. Okay, in that case. Yep. I'll be brave. It's, the problem is the invisible is down. It's in the bottom card. Dark frenzy and into the night. Smoke bomb and the daggers. Meanwhile, this one. Okay, now hopefully I can kill this living spirit. Plus two, yeah. Okay, good, good, good. Move five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Going invisible. Now even if I get a minus one, it should kill this thing. So yeah, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna advantage because I can't afford to fail that now I can heal myself one two three four one okay so no matter what uh sawbones is gonna get hit so I guess I'll just tank it I'll just tank it here. 
keep movement yep and then gonna consume it again to bring back healing mixture. Ah, uh, why you move so far away? Okay, phew, plus you. I wanted to do combo brain leech and something. Perverse edge. I can stun this thing. Stun. Then mass hysteria. One, two, three, four. Gosh, what can I do? Uh, mass hysteria. Ah, what to do? Dang. Dang. Long rest? What? Okay, okay, fine. In that case, I can... I can stun it and heal myself. <laughs> what kind of strategy is this? Oh. Okay, in that case, medical. Oh wow, and they're slow this time. Double stun. Okay. Oh yeah, this is fine. So then they're gonna move towards the mine tree, and then she can do the combo next. Time. And they're generating ice, which I can consume technically. Hey, phew! Attacking with this advantage, plus zero or eight times two. That is scary. Swift bow with throwing knives. Throwing knives can go right. So now I can do this. Uh, flanking strike and special mixture. One, two, three. Yep. And he can do this. Move three, four. Okay. Flanking strike with advantage because I cannot afford to. if I get a critical fail it won't die so it's too important I have to so, yeah. oh it's already poisoned what am I doing anyways now I'm gonna do this times two oh last turn before long resting so I guess I can do this skip attack with blood plus one okay this is going well I thought it was actually going pretty badly but hey it's all good so open wound 
both I guess we can no actually we need the bottom part no I, I got an idea uh hidden daggers no 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 single out and ski open med pack one two three four five six ski med pack I'm gonna use the single out to go here Skippy. Q Yep, that's it Okay, let's go, come on Come on, game, heal Yep, and then the, We need This is good Mass hysteria can go long rest, perform long rest And then take out Vaccine Vaccine is actually pretty good. Healing, make sure it's good. Everything is good. <laughs> Everything is good. Uh, hamstring. Hamstring. Vaccine. Vaccine. Okay, so I still need. Okay, one more experience. Okay, so first aid and precaution as always. We can go. Swift bow to get the goldies. Ah, whatever. And then into the night and scurry. Should I want to? I guess we can into the night and scurry. Mind Thief needs the map pack this time. Okay, so uh, Sawbones finished his personal quest. I mean, battle goals. Alright, let's see what's in here. More hounds. Move four. Now the question is do I want to block the door or do I want to let them pass? Actually I think I wanna let them pass. Because I want them to come to me, then I want to attack them. Skippy and then Good. Yeah, this is good. Kill all enemies in all rooms treasure chest is over there which we're definitely going to get yeah I I may have used the cranium overload too fast but at the same time everything is still going smoothly so it's still fine technically now I think I'm just going to use swift bow one two three four yeah I think I'm going to do that okay. Yeah, I'm definitely using uh, hidden daggers to kill all these living spirits. Okay. This is still good. We're still going to win. Get the mind thief is. Okay, that's fine. I'm going to do... I need the bottom one for the strength thing. She needs to attack twice and then she's going to use her cloak of invisibility and she's going to go invisible. Okay, so smoke bomb. I should smoke bomb and hit it. Wait. Wait, actually. Smoke bomb now and then med medical. Shit. And then I'm just gonna use the hidden dagger. Oof. 
so fast. Immobilize. Well, okay, it's fine. Immobilize is fine. Attack one, strength. the question do i want to attack the frost demon again or do i want to attack one of the living spirits because she is actually going to prepare a heavy damage to them at first i was thinking of attacking the living spirit but now i'm contemplating on So I'll take Thanks too. Perfect. Now the living spirit is late. Hmm. One damage. I may not have to use the curve invisibility. What? I'll attack. Time zero. It's fine. Heal. Should I drink a stunning potion here? is fine. Cannot reach. Okay, okay, this one can reach. Minus one ball, zero damage. Just gonna stay here. Good. Perfect. Arm everything good. Uh, I'm not sure. <laughs> what should I do? Disarm everything and then curse all enemies within range. But totally not afraid. Afraid at all. Wait, actually, undo. Let me just this one. <coughs> Plus two.
I don't think I want to go invisible. setup is so long all the living spirits are just gonna curse it's it's not scary at all gonna take a while I can already see what's going to happen in the next three turns the problem is it's taking uh, the video longer <laughs> I, it's like this is like if this is chess I can see four or five turns ahead he is long resting I'm fine with this long resting as well meanwhile he is going to attack Wow, muddle. Yep, <laughs> the wolf is definitely going to die. But I guess this turn, living spirit is going to attack for a lot of damage. But it's fine. It's it's really fine. For example, I'm going to attack and stun this one. Right. So I kind of want to attack this one to right away kill it. But at the same time, it's stun anyway. So I'm just gonna attack this one. I kind of want to short rest, but actually, yeah, short rest is good. Syringe, oh, I kind of need that. I need that one. Redraw, hamstring, good. Bye bye, hamstring. Now what I want to do is, ooh, I can disarm everything. But what I really want is this one. Prevention is key. Times two. Oh, okay, there we go. Now I'm definitely gonna take the chest before I finish this. So. Times two. Okay. Oh my. 
my gosh, there's both darkness and ice. I could have gone so many. Oh, I can do it. Unfortunately, I'm not going to kill this one yet. Swift bow. Kids farming. Yeah, it's taking a while. I apologize for the long video. But yeah. And the loot. Just walk into the trap. Miss. Sawbones because Sawbones is faster than Skunk. Okay, so short, uh, short. long rest because no choice. We're just bullying this li living spirit. Stop! Stop! I'm already dead! <laughs> I'm already dead. Stop bullying the ghost! Go for a long rest, hurry up, come on! And this. First man is kind of uh, Into the night for the looting. First aid. Now, do I want experience or go? Go. So burn. Then the uh, so far away. Can I get something before moving? Yes, curative mix and uh, I'll try it. Consume ice to start. Flanking strike with advantage, dealing 11, 12. And Eleven damage. Aha! And then the gold is mine. Which one of these have more gold? I cannot check. Fine. This one. Get the chest. Hurry! I'm scared. If I fail to take it, do it. VV loots twenty gold. Everybody else needs the gold. <laughs> Vivi is the last person that needs gold. Uh, all she's doing is just <laughs> donating gold to the tree. <laughs> my voice. Curative mix for myself. Three gold and gold is there. Come on, I need to check. I cannot check. Actually, we already know there's three gold there, so might as well gamble. Three gold, right? Yep, three gold. <coughs> Excuse me. And there we go. Victory. With Easy. the last of your adversaries dead, you approach the back of the chamber, where a small blue sphere floats above the floor. You slowly reach out your hand and find the orb cold to the touch. With a firm grip on it, the temperature is almost unbearable, but you quickly stash it into your pack and make your way back to the crooked bone. Nice. 
kill five or more. I kind of forgot about that. Everybody gets a perk point. That's good. That's always good. Ah, water. H2O. Hey, more cuts. You enter the abandoned tavern and call out to hail. With no response, you wander around, observing the chaotic mess around you. You wonder how she gets any work done in this environment. As you approach the counter, Hale appears before you, holding the orb. Very interesting. She doesn't seem to notice you at all. A rift in our plane, somehow contained within a spherical barrier. Good thing you didn't break this on your way back. It's a snow globe. You easily could have been sucked into a realm of pure frost and been frozen solid before you had time to breathe. Or something worse could have happened. It's just so confounding. Who would have the power to do this? Hale takes a step to the left and disappears again. You wait for what feels like hours, refusing to sit on the few stools that haven't yet fallen apart. You call out occasionally, but receive no response. Oh, you're still here. You turn around to see Hale in the middle of the room. Good. I'd like to experiment on you if it's all right. She reaches out to you and you stumble backward, falling over a table that splinters into hundreds of pieces. Oh, don't be a baby about it. I'm pretty sure it will end well. Hale explains that she wants to try to bring forth raw power from another plane and contain it in a small orb that could give enhanced powers to anyone possessing it. The containment process, however, requires a lot of gold metal. Now that you have helped me in my endeavors, I suppose I should return the favor, Hale sighs. So, what was it exactly that you wanted? Okay, cool. Unlock Enchantress. What is Enchantress? <gasps> is it? Is it? Oh, baby. Oh, there it is. Enchantress. We can upgrade our stuff here. Wow, awesome. Nice. Now, in the board game, there's something like if you generate darkness like 10 times, 20 times, you, you can unlock stuff. Yeah. See? Uh, yeah. So, finally, we unlock enchanting. This is really good. I'll be doing this next next time. But yeah, wow, finally. Yep, we'll be doing all of this later. Jeez. Uh, but please. Okay, let's go to the Temple Great Book. We'll bless the mighty. And now we're just going to choose our cards. Uh, this one, I think. Please. Ooh, consistency. Yep, consistency. So Victor leveled up. Level four, what do we get? Blood transfusion. Wow. Attack three, heal two adjacent allies. Not so good. Do no harm. Move four and heal three. Now that's good. Kill one adjacent normal or elite enemy. And then disarm and immobilize self. Next turn. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Do no harm. You should do no harm because I'm taking it. Wow. This is for the last room. Elite enemy. Yeah, you're dead. Yeah. Oh, beautiful. That is beautiful. Try it. Uh, Vaccine. Uh, sure. Hand of the surgeon. Yeah. Do more. Do more. Do no harm. Two heal three cards. Two wound cards. Ah oh, yeah, that's good. But he's rarely attacking. And when I do attack, I'm using wound. Add plus one and 
plus two rolling modifier. Wow. Replace. Oh my god, this is so good. But if I if I do remove, then the more likely I'm going to pull a two minus two or minus one. Rolling modifier is good as long as you don't get the the critical fail. Oh my gosh. Ah what to get? What to get? Yes, everything is so good. Everything is so good though. I don't know what to get. I really don't know what to get. This video has gone long enough. Uh, we'll do the shopping and everything else later, especially in Chandra's and Pinko. Yep, okay. So, yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope this video is not too long. So, yeah. I guess I'll see you in next next Gloomhaven video where I do more enchant, enchant, enchanting. Yep, okay. <laughs> okay, so take care, my shinies. Have a good night. See you. Bye-bye.